Hi, my name is Rizzo and I'm a behavior technician here at Chimp Haven. Today I'm going to talk to you about the various kinds of enrichment that we offer to our chimps. Every month we put together a calendar of different enrichment to provide them throughout the weeks. And it is broken down into two types of categories, either food or non-food. They very obviously have a preference for their food enrichment and we break that down further into several categories. Novel food, which is food they haven't had in a long time, something exotic for them on their diet. Uh, occupational enrichment, which is an item that they get to be occupied with, something that they have to take apart in order to eat. Fishers, which are meant to get them to use tools and use their mind to work with something through the mesh on their enclosures. And then forage, which is simply something that is scattered on the ground to encourage that natural foraging behavior they would do in the wild. Non-food enrichment is broken up further into destructibles and sensory enrichment. Destructibles are items like paper, cloth, of which we get all sorts of different kinds, and it's up to the chimp to decide what they're gonna do with it. If it's gonna be nesting material, if they're gonna use it as a tool, or maybe they're just gonna play with it and throw it around like confetti like Carly does. And then with our sensory enrichment, that is also pretty straightforward. It could be a light projector, it could be a bubble machine, it could be smells, something that uh, engages their senses, something novel and new to their environment. Today, they're actually gonna be getting coconuts, which kind of comes together as both a novel and occupational enrichment. They do not get coconuts very often, um, and so today, they're gonna try and figure out how to get into them. Some of the chimps might be quicker at it than others, so we'll see who does well on coconut day. 